Since the first playable characters came out, the devs have released numerous updates and today the new update came out that everyone has been waiting for. It's called the Scientific Revolution. The update is so far exclusive, exclusive to only these areas, and from our understanding, the rest of the map should see these updates sooner or later, but most likely depending on sales from the release area. This patch sometimes bugs out for new players who might experience a permanent black screen when first loading in or within the first six year cutscene. This means that your playtime is over. Now from what we've seen so far, the patch seems fairly balanced and adds a lot of new content for players to play with, which also creates a lot of new paid professions. These professions include the astronomy and physics fields, which were previously part of the philosopher's skill tree, but are now careers of their own. This opens up new play styles for a variety of different players. This update introduces some new items and other content that stand out from the other updates, with extraterrestrial events occurring at random intervals throughout game sessions. Two of these events are comets and supernovae, which can be seen with the help of a new item that was added in this patch, known as the telescope released by the creator Galileo. Included with these new events and this item is leaked information from the devs about how the skybox interacts with ground textures. We now know that the current stages actually aren't at the center of the map and because of this the devs might release extraterrestrial stages for exploration in later patches. In addition some of the previously known bugs were actually hidden patches that were added when the game was originally released that players are just now discovering due to the leaks from the game devs during this update. These leaks reveal that there's a max speed attribute on every player and object added so far, and that the only aspect of the game that can reach max speed is the luminescence property of the environment. Isaac Noon revealed a new mathematics perk that was added to the skill tree that increases the mathematics level cap. This perk is referred to by players as calculus, and while it was first revealed in this patch by Isaac Newton, it was also independently leaked by Gottfried Leibniz. Another item that was added is called bifocals, which was released by the creator Benjamin Franklin. And while at first it seems like a vanity item, it actually helps improve the vision of higher level players by a large amount. Added with these items were some new major NPCs, including Francis Bacon and Rene Descartes, that came with the Scientific Method and Rationalism DLC, which have changed the story of the game drastically since the last patch. These game-changing NPCs will probably affect future patches as well, even if they disappear in the next patch. This patch also greatly increases the abilities of the Science Faction, which used to be a minor faction, but with this patch, they became one of the most powerful factions, and this causes major conflict between factions that used to support them, especially the Christian factions. E.